well, from my side, things are going according to plan. It's, it's a little bit of crisis management here and there, but that's what we're trained to do, and that's what we do best. So, yeah, no, no, we, uh, we're getting there. We're happy. We're happy for my son, Caroline. I'm sure you can give your opinions. Here. Yeah, I think we've got a lot of challenges. We're seeing a lot of patients, and we're expecting to see a lot more today. So it's challenging, the team is tired, but they, it's an excellent team, they're really working nicely together and we're pretty happy with where we're at. We're now going to make a big bag. Yeah. Yeah, we'll try today. 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 Gaan, man! Helmut! Adrian, could you tell us about today? Yeah, for sure. Um, today was an extremely tough day. Um, I was out at water point three, been out at the water points for most of the, the race so far. Um, and uh, today was a lot of heat um, and a lot of fluid loss, uh, not so much wind luckily. Um, but we haven't seen as much heat in the Apex so far, so um, essentially what we mainly saw today was a lot of dehydration, a lot of fatigue, um, and a lot of nausea, vomiting, and, and, and some gastroenteritis. Um, and this all stems mainly from, from a lack of, of oral hydration, um, lack of, 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 of adequate nourishment, and um, as well as eating too much sugar-based foods. Okay, so when I came across the finish line, I was hot. The uh, temperature wouldn't come down. Jittery. And uh, now after the drip, I'm feeling warm but comfortable, uh, not that jittery sort of feeling anymore and also my, um, it doesn't feel like I'm breathing through my ears anymore, it doesn't sound like I'm breathing through my ears anymore. Do you need a hug? 